My girlfriend Reb is a bit of a rambunctious personality. If you've seen any of our content together, you'll quickly realize that she is not afraid to speak her mind, which in most cases is a good thing. But with a heavy heart, I have to come to you bearing a shocking truth. That's right, my girlfriend is being cancelled. I'll explain. It all started when my girlfriend made this post on Twitter. Before I show the image, here's a warning, because buddy, this will make your stomach churn. Last chance. Okay, here we go. Is immeasurable. Ew! Dude! My day is what the f Now I know, staring at the mere sight of this is the equivalent of being flashbanged by the sun. But if you don't get what you're looking at, it is quite possibly the worst fast food tier list I have ever seen. Not only did she put five guys all the way at the bottom, but Taco Bell in S plus tier? Really? Or Dunkin' Donuts above In-N-Out? That's offensive. God, that's offensive. I couldn't let Reb get away with this, and I knew that something had to be done. So here's what I did. I ordered something from every single one of these restaurants that was available near my home. I knew ordering a random item from every restaurant wouldn't be fair, so I stuck to the most fundamental staple of every restaurant's menu. Chicken. Nuggets. And to clear Reb's bias, I made sure she was blindfolded while tasting the entire time. In order to convince her to come on and do this, we also made a bet that every single answer she had that was consistent with her original tier list, I would gift her five subs. And every single answer she got incorrectly, I would be gifted five subs. Was her tier list all smoke and mirrors? Or does she actually have taste buds that are that bad? Let's find out. Also, this order cost me over $200, so if you could find it in your heart, please subscribe because it helps out the channel. Uh, okay, okay, uh, I think that's it. Um, love you. Uh, let's go. Front facing rib. <laughs> Why are you doing that? Stop. I don't know, it's scaring them. Stop doing that. Front facing rib. You look like a creep. Front facing rib isn't real. She cannot hurt you. <laughs> Literally too much to carry. Make sure there's no addresses, please. There's, I see some right there. Put it down. Scooch be like, bro, let's do a fun stream and then doxes us. I did my makeup. I don't want to put on a blindfold. Close your eyes and keep them closed. Can I put a bag over my head? Yeah, get a bag. Okay. Uh, Which bag? Choose a bag. Don't do this at home. No, 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 <laughs> not that one. Jesus, don't do that. What if we just put a, like a black bar on Streamlabs? We open up a, a black image and then we'll blindfold you like that. Okay, deal. All right, everyone, are you guys ready? Can everyone in chat real quick do me a favor? Go get a bag. Go get a bag. I need Go you guys to get a bag, bag so you could f***ing puke in after looking at this take. All right, because it's a pretty bad take. It is actually so bad. Reb said the most cancelable take ever. Not actually. Preface it with not actually. Actually. This is, this is grounds for, what did they do? Ooh, to Jesus? I'm just kidding. It's a meme. All right. Anyways, this is grounds for dismissal is what I'm saying. This is this is almost got to send her back to Greece type beat. Are you threatening to deport me back to my my poor country? That's kind of <laughs> fucked up. All right. Reb tweeted the other day. And when I say the other day, I mean yesterday, which is why this wound is still fresh. She tweeted yesterday the words, if you hate me, kill me or shut the f up. And with that, she tweeted this. Look, guys, I need you guys to see this. All right. Now comes the truth, okay? Big day for the feeder community. Shut up. <laughs> she's not gonna eat all of it, guys. Relax. I mean, she's not gonna fucking Kirby inhale. You ready? All right, guys. Number one. Hmm. Huh? You're eating it too? No, I'm, <laughs> I'm hungry. Look at that a bee. Look at that a bee, huh? Mm -hmm. Interesting. Mm, no, see, see, the aftertaste is good. <clears throat> mm -mm. No, no, I want it to see. The aftertaste is kind of alcoholic. Are you eating it first? Yeah, well, no, no, I'm not. All right, you ready? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. What the fuck is that? Mm. D, that's fucking gross. That was disgusting, yeah. That's fucking gross. I agree. Maybe I agree. even lower, but I'm going to keep it in deeper now to play. No, you can, you, can, you can move it around if you want. Yuck, that just tasted like pepper. You ready? Yeah, are you? Mm. I'm going to go one. What? Well, you're being dumb on purpose. Mm -mm. It's delicious. It's delicious. I don't know what you're talking about. Hey. I, it is all breading. I haven't even gotten chicken. I like breading. It could be a little crispier. 
That's uh-huh. why I'm not putting it in Ash. Rob, I don't like that you're not blindfolded. I'll be honest with you. Then get me a fucking blindfold. Let me get her a blindfold. All right, cool. Now I trust you a lot. You ready? It gets experimental here. Oh god, I'm scared. Open. What the fuck? Oh god, can I spit this out? No. God, please. Uh -uh. I'm not joking, please. Um, uh Oh, what is this? F for sure. What the fuck is that? Oh god, that was gross. That tasted like chicken left in a construction zone in the hot California sun for two weeks. What the fuck are you doing to me? Nothing. Stop laughing. Here you go. This is just the last one. (laughs) This is literally the last one. (laughs) Give me a fucking napkin. (laughs) (laughs) It tastes like fruit. Fruit? It tastes like expired fruit. Why is it sugary? Uh, This is actually a new one. I just thought it'd be funny to get you with that again. That's not funny. Hmm. Okay. This one's actually really good. A little mushy. I'm gonna give that a solid A. Bottom below the other one though. Hmm. Okay, wait. It has a weird like seafood act- aftertaste, but still put it at the bottom of A. Actually, top of B. I can feel stomach pains. I don't know if that's from this one or the next one. Or that- the prior one. Mm-hmm. Oh, all right. This is going to be a weird one. Oh boy. Okay. Now I warn you, this one's gonna be a little weird. <sighs> It sounds like it's complex. I, I don't know if I'm a fan of that already, off the bat. I'm a pretty simple person. I'm getting- I got the closest thing- What the thing. fuck is this crinkle? I'm getting a fork. Okay. Oh no. It's messy, isn't it? A little. Oh. Oh no. I don't like it. Mm. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Come on! That's good! Mm-mm. I can smell that. That's good. But my personal bias doesn't really like sauce. Like, thrown in sauce, you know? Yeah, but that's good! I'll put it at the top of C. Top of C. That's good. Like, it's not bad. Mm. It's just, I wouldn't choose to eat it. So it gets a very average, but passing grade. Now, I don't mean to scare you or alarm you, but I don't have, I don't know what to tell you about this next one. I really don't. I genuinely don't know. I'm scared. I've never tried this. Mm. Another bite? Yeah. I don't hate it. It's just nothing remarkable. I agree. Nothing to write home about. Put it at the bottom of B. That, mm. That's your third highest rated. Really? Yeah. It's okay. It's nothing crazy. Like, I wouldn't go out of my way to get it, I don't think. There's no way you don't know what this is. Okay. It's McDonald's. There's no way you don't know what this Give is. Give me the whole nugget. Oh, fuck. It's fucking rock, right? I can't say yes or no to any of that. It's a star. It's actually really good. You know kids' cuisine? Yeah. It tastes like kid cuisine. I agree. I'm gonna put it in F. What? <laughs> Below the other one, actually. Actually, no, above the other one, because it doesn't taste bad. It just doesn't taste like anything. So top of F. It tastes like it was frozen like 45 minutes ago. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And it tastes like alcohol. I don't taste any chicken there. I don't agree with that last bit. I could agree that it does taste like kids' cuisine, though. It, it tastes like, it's just weird. It's not chicken. It's not pepper. It's not seasoning. It's like, I, I don't even want to swallow it. Can I have a napkin? I feel like if I was drunk, I would enjoy it. Or a child. I could see that, yeah. Hmm. There's a lot of things going on right now. Right now, okay, the chicken tastes stale right off the bat. But I don't think that's, I think that's a user error rather than yeah. a manufacturer error. I could see that, I could see that. You know, you bite into it, if you get past the staleness, there's this explosion of like spice. Mm, that's pretty good, but it feels a bit, the staleness, I can't get past the staleness, but I know that might just be because they were made like four hours ago or last night. I'm gonna have to put it at the middle of C. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but the flavor's really good. It's just the consistency is very off. The consistency can vary based on a lot of factors. Mm -hmm. Like opening time, how much the employee on shift didn't give a shit, you know? And you know what? Fair. Like (laughs) if the employee's having a bad day. Exactly. Like, I don't really care. It'll translate into your nuggets. Exactly. Do we not do this yet? Ready? Open your mouth. God, please. No, not again. Hold up. I could have swore we already did this because the bag's ripped, but I guess I didn't put it, so I guess you got to redo it. No, no, we did not do this. Mm. Mm Mm-mm. 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 Can I have an Okay. I have a lot to say about this one. I have a lot to say about this one. They're trying to mask the fact that the chicken isn't cooked all the way through by well, putting a ton of pepper on it. I could see the pepper being a too big a factor here. Pepper and lemon. A weird, <clears throat> zesty, citrusy undertone, right? Yeah, yeah. I could see that. I could see that. Maybe it's a big thing might be because it's cold. I feel like it has to be eaten warm, which kind of skews it. Okay. I'm going to put it at the top of B. Bro, this tier list must be looking weird, huh? It's a little funny. Really? Yeah, it's definitely fun. Hmm. 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 So this is 
interesting because it doesn't taste like a chicken nugget. It has the consistency of a chicken nugget, but it tastes like a jalapeno popper. Am I, am I correct with that observation? I could see that, yeah. Is this like a limited edition flavor where they put like dusting on it? I think, yeah. I think it is. Okay, because that's that's kind of hard, but I really do like it. It's not bad. That was that was surprising to me. Yeah. Um. I don't know. They were like juicy too, which is the impressive. The consistency was really good. Yeah. The flavoring felt kind of artificial. I'm not going to lie. It felt like if you walked into a Chili's and the table next to you ordered jalapeno poppers as a starter and you went, ooh, that smells good. Maybe I should get that. But it wasn't taste it was the smell i'm gonna put it at the bottom of b do not feel good i will tell you that right now this feels like something the government would do to torture people blindfold them and make them try different chickens i don't know how to not spoil it but it's a i can hear foil i'm thinking howling rays but it's a taco oh it's taco bell open your mouth your mistake i didn't have him your mistake was getting soft shell i feel like this is like it's not very accurate so that's shredded chicken in a soft shell taco. You need the variety, right? You need hard shell, soft chicken, cheese, sour cream, uh, and then the spiciest sauce they have. Mm -hmm. So you bite into it and it goes. The I feel like that's skewed. Maybe don't put that on the list. No, you gotta. I feel bad though, because I love Taco Bell. It's just you got something I didn't like. Um, Just put it on the list. Okay, if it was on the list, it would be a low F, but okay. I'm not gonna give you subs for that one. Um, That's not Taco Bell. What? Yeah. What is it? Um, we'll, we'll discuss soon. Okay, bottom of F. It was dog shit. Who the fuck would have a taco? Del Taco? El Pollo Loco. Oh, I forgot about that one. Yeah. So it's things I didn't rank as well. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's wherever had chicken near us. Oh, Jesus. Is that it? That was I really think that gross. Is it. That was really gross. I think that's it. Can I take this off? Yeah. Holy shit. Oh. So this is Reb's old list. Okay. Taco Bell, KFC, Dunkin' Donuts, Chick-fil-A, blah, 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 right? Now, Reb's new list. Are you guys ready? Boom! Let me move me down. Oh! What? <laughs> My baby's still an A. <laughs> to be fair, he was an S last time. Well, I didn't want to give anything an S. All right, so let's see which ones you got right. KFC, I'm going to give you the point for KFC okay. because it's the highest rated. Right, yeah. Okay, so I'll give you the point for KFC. Okay. KFC is an A. Okay. Okay. Popeyes, you got in B. But that should be considered A, right? But that should be considered A. Okay. Because you didn't want to give anything an S. And yeah. honestly, I should dock you. I really should. I really should. But I did the math and I still win here if I don't dock you. So Sonic and Jack. You didn't do Sonic last time, but Jack in the Box was nowhere near up there. You should give me like 10 subs yeah, for that. Yeah, I'm shocked. Which one was Jack in the Box? Jack in the Box was the, the popcorn chicken, one of the last ones. Oh, that's pretty good. They're actually really good yeah. if you want more. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I ranked Jack in the Box there because every time I've ordered it, people, other people ate it. Not bad. Mm, it's like, good. Yeah, yeah. Okay. They have like a nice color to them and everything. Mm, Panda like Express. Panda Express, you gave a C here. That's a D here. We're not, we're not going to keep giving you points because you've knocked everything down. Okay? I just gave you those first. Dude. All right. Burger King was a C. You get that one. McD's, I win there. Dude, I don't even remember having McDonald's. That was the one that you said is human error. Oh, yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What right? was the disgusting one that I spit out? That was Chick-fil-A. No way. That was Chick-fil-A. No way. That was why I was that's like, whoa, crazy. that's crazy. Yeah. No way. That's crazy. I'll be honest. Your taste buds were kind of on point. Right? As in, like, you could kind of tell what you liked and hated. Yeah. And to be fair, this was chicken. Your take is still bad. You're just consistent. And that is something that we could respect while we take I you out. I am consistently a contrarian. I will tell you this. With food, with movies, with music, he knows. It pisses him off every day. I didn't like Fight Club. I thought Fight Club was the most dog shit movie I've watched in the past decade. And yet I made him sit through Interview with the Vampire last night. And that movie's fucking dog shit. It was awesome. I am consistently a contrarian, but not on purpose. I just have very weird taste. All right, we get it. I'm... I'm a hipster, bro. I'm well, sorry. How many subs do you owe me? You owe me a decent amount. I will round it up to 25. 20. 25. Chick-fil-A, Wendy's, McDonald's, I think we Jack can do 25. in the Box. I think we can do 25. And you owe me KFC, Popeyes, Burger King. No. It's not how it works. You don't cancel it <laughs> Yes, out. it is. The winner take all. No fucking way. Yes, it is. No fucking way. I don't owe you anything. You're wrong. Fair. It is fair. You should have read the fucking contract. <laughs> mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. You owe me 15, I owe you 20, which means you get five gifted. I did not do all of this for five gifted subs. You owe me 25 subs. You're gonna make me sit here blindfolded, force feed me disgusting plastic chicken, and then make me pay you money while you get the views on your Twitch channel. 
Now give me 25 gifted subs. I'm gifting subs. you five. No way. You're going to just give me five. I'm going to do it. Oh, this is awful. I hate her. And there you have it, her final tier list. Believe it or not, it was actually a lot closer than I would have expected, but at the end of the entire experiment, she did pay me a staggering five subs. After Twitch's cut, that's about $13. Not even enough to cover one set of the nuggets, huh? Damn it. Follow me over on twitch.tv slash scooch to catch more of this content live. I hope you enjoyed the video and subscribe if you want to see more like it. That's it. That's all I got. Love ya.